Hey guys, what's up? My name is Malover and welcome back to another YouTube video on my channel. I hope you're all doing good. I know it's been very long since I made my last YouTube video, but I really want to get back on YouTube and post more videos for you guys. I really enjoy it. But anyways, in today's video, I will be showing you guys my updated go-to makeup look that I do whenever I'm going out or I'm taking pictures for Instagram. It's like my go-to full face of makeup. It's not my everyday makeup because this is like a full face one. I also have like a everyday makeup look i will show you guys that one as well in a different video but yeah if you'd like to see how i do my go-to full face of makeup then just keep on watching start off by clipping back my hair that's my rabbit if y'all didn't know now that my hair is cut back and looking a bit weird I hope you can't hear my dog downstairs. I'm gonna start off by moisturizing my face. I'm gonna be using this L'Oreal moisturizer and I'm just gonna say, excuse my nails guys. They've been on for like six weeks, just leave that. I'm gonna be using this L'Oreal moisturizer and for my lips, the best lip gloss. This Essence Juicy Balm and I'm just gonna put some on my lips. And I have lip stain on, so if you're wondering if I have lip liner on, I do not. It stays on for like one to two days, but I applied it yesterday, so it's still on if you're wondering why i'm gonna go in with okay now and i'm just gonna put it on my whole face Now, I'm gonna go in with some MAC Strobe Cream. I put almost everything in like a travel size. I'm just gonna put that wherever I want some like extra glow. Now for the actual makeup, I'm gonna go in with the L'Oreal. These two, the shade 330 and the 26. I'm starting with the 330. 326. Look absolutely crazy right now, but we move. I go and blend it in, and I'm gonna use my ColourPop F15 brush and a B blender. Now that my concealer is blended, going in with my foundation, I'm gonna be using this Fit Me foundation. Anastasia Stick Foundation in Amber to use as a contour stick. I'm gonna go in with the same two concealers and I'm just gonna brighten my face. I'm gonna set my face with the Revolution Banana Powder. Add some pictures in here. I mixed the Revolution Light Banana and the White Powder. I just want like an extra bright powder. I'm gonna leave the powder on for a bit. Now I'm gonna do my contour while the powder is still setting on my face. I do not know how to pronounce that, but I'm gonna use that one. And it's in the shade Deeper Bronzer. This little mini brush that I think you get in the Benefit Bronzer, but I'm not gonna be using this one. I'm just gonna use the brush. Now that I've done my contour, I'm still gonna leave the powder under my eyes set for a little bit more. I'm gonna go in with a blush. Guys, this is all broken and I use tape to close it, but we move. This is the Balm Hot Mama blush. And I'm also gonna use a little bit of the Revolution blusher. Well, the Revolution blusher reloaded in rhubarb and custard. And I'm just gonna mix these two. 
And I forgot to say what brush, it's a blending brush from Colourpop F9 brush. Now I'm going to use this setting brush and I'm just going to brush away the powder I have in my face. I'm going to set my base with the MAC Fix Plus spray. Now before I apply my highlighter, I'm gonna go in with a little bit more powder and I'm just gonna set like around my nose and under my eyes. Like that, and now for the highlighter. I'm gonna use my own highlighter that I released together with Makeup Store. I've been using this for at least like four years and I don't think you can buy it anymore because it was sold a while ago and I think it's sold out. But I'm gonna be using this one and I'm gonna go in with the same brush that I used for my blush. And now, my light wanted to die. For my brows, I'm just gonna take a Q-tip and I'm gonna clean my brows so that I don't have to like foundation in that one. For my brows, I actually don't fill in my eyebrows anymore. I'm just gonna set them with like a brow gel to like set my brows in place. And I'm gonna be using the NYX brow glue and I'm just gonna brush them through. Like that, now that my brows are done, I like to do this little thing that I've been doing for a couple of weeks for my eyelids that just like gives extra glow with this Anastasia liquid glow in the shade Oyster. And I'm just gonna take some on my fingers. I'm just gonna all over. Now I'm just gonna go in with my Real Techniques brush again and I'm just gonna brush out the powder that I put on after the X Plus. Now I only have my lips left. If you've been following me for a while, I'm gonna be using the same lip combo because I haven't found anyone that I like more than this, which is the Anastasia Brow Definer in the shade Auburn and the NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Fortune Cookie overline my lips because I like the look of it so just line your lips however you like but this is how I do it hey guys so that was actually it for my updated go to full face of makeup thank you so much for watching i hope you guys liked this video and if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my youtube channel and follow me on instagram and tiktok everything is down below as always and i'll see you guys in my next video bye